Hey, how you doing? I'm Rack from Rack Attacks Reviews, and I'm here to talk to you about my review of The Shape of Water, the new Del Toro movie. Um, I'm just in the middle of a bushwalk, so forgive all the nature noise and everything like that. But um, yeah, The Shape of Water, it uh, really was not what I was expecting. Um, don't worry, I'm not gonna have any spoilers or anything like that. But the film itself was, how do I say it? It's it's very much a, a date movie more than like, I pictured it to be like a horror-esque sort of style monster movie where a girl falls in love with the creature from the Black Lagoon. Almost I was thinking it was like another dark universe's <laughs> entry sort of like uh, origin story movies. Um, but no, it was something completely different. It's, it's more of a, a love story, like a romantic love story um, that you would even bring your girlfriend along to, which has like a monster and something like that. Um, yeah, I, it, even though it, because I, I sort of came out of it with a, a slight bit of taste, because I, I, I guess I went in not knowing what to expect, and when I came out with, I didn't expect that at all. But I've got to say, it, it has stuck with me, with me since I've seen it, and it's, it's left a lasting impression. So for that, I definitely say this is a must see. I can see why it's won the Golden Globe. It was beautifully shot, beautifully done. Um, the world itself is just so rich and everything. It's a really good movie. Though I think it's probably would be better on the small screen at home. And uh, then out at the cinemas, it, it's like, you saw the trailer makes it seem as like horror-esque and it's got action and stuff in it. There's really only one action scene throughout the whole film. The rest of it's sort of just um, the creature and the main character sort of building a relationship together. So it might not be a cinema movie, but if you've got a free ticket or you can get it at a really, really cheap discount, then I say, yeah, definitely worth going to go see um, at the cinemas. Otherwise, yeah, just wait for it to come out and watch it at home. Um, if, if I had to give it like a star rating, I'd give it like a four star. So it is good. It was really enjoyable. Um, but yeah, um, sort of go in with no expectations. Uh, don't picture it to be anything else but what it is. So just go in expecting just a weird del toro style love story and you won't come out disappointed but um yeah probably better just to wait for it to come out and watch it at home but um yeah until then guys take care and i'll speak to you later